hello guys you're welcome to my youtube channel and in today's video i'm going to show you how you can easily create a pioneer account that you can use to send and receive money internationally so say for example you are into freelancing you could actually set up a pioneer account then gain access to usd bank account and send to your client and use it to receive payment from them or send to your customer and use it to receive payment from them so if you're into e-commerce job shipping or any sort of online business that requires you to have a us bank account to receive payment from your customer or client you can definitely set up a pioneer account and use it to get paid so in today's video i'm going to show you exactly how you can set it up get access to your us bank account and use it to receive payment from your customer so the first thing we have to do now is to go to the description of the video so i'm going to add a link at the description of the video so just go there when you click the link you get to see a page like this so when you click the link you get to gain access to 50 dollars sign up bonus so when you create your account with peonia you'll be able to access this bonus of 50 dollars when you receive certain amount of money into your peonia account all right so to get started just click on this sign up button that says sign up and earn 50 dollars so when you click on it it's going to redirect you to where you can actually create your account all right so this is the sign up form so the first thing you can see here is is your business registered with any government business licensing or tax authorities no my business isn't registered yes i own a registered business so if you have an incorporated business in the us that is if you want to register a business account with peonia the second option is what you're going to choose so since you're going to be opening a personal account so the first option is what you're going to be selecting all right so leave it at no my business isn't registered so the next thing you want to do here is come over here then enter your first name enter your last name your email address re-enter the email address then your date of birth so once you've done that the next thing you want to do is come over here then click on next so you can proceed so let me quickly enter my so we can proceed all right so i've just entered that so the next thing i'm going to do now is to click on the next button now this is just a dummy account because i already have an account with building already so this is just to walk you through how you can get it done yourself all right so um what we're going to do now is click on next so the next step here is your contact details so what you want to do is you want to select your country after you selected your country you want to enter your streets and number then after that scroll down then enter your mobile number so the mobile number you entered here they're going to send a verification code to this number so make sure the number is correct so once you enter the number an otp is going to be sent to the number enter the otp here and once you verify the number all you simply need to do is scroll down then click on next so let me quickly enter mine so we can proceed all right so i've just entered my contact details i've entered uh, my street number my town my postal code and added my phone number and a verification code has been sent to the phone number and i've just entered it so once you've done that in your own case the next thing you have to do is just scroll down then click on next so at this stage they're going to ask you to enter a password for your account so enter your password here then we enter the password then after that and um, come over to security question here then select a security question for yourself so this security question is one of the things they're going to be asking you in case you lost your password or you want to reactivate your pioneer account or something like that so just scroll through the security question and choose the one you are certain you're going to remember so i'm going to um go with the first one then i'm going to enter the security answer here then after that enter your um, national id for you to verify your account so what you want to do is you want to select your country then once you've selected your country select the id type you're going to be using if it's going to be national id if it's going to be driver's license passport just choose the one you're going to be using then after that enter the phone and um, enter the id number here so let me quickly enter mine so we can proceed so i've entered all my details so the next thing i'm going to do now is come over here then click on next so finally what you're going to be doing here is to enter an account that you're going to be using to withdraw the money that comes into your pioneer account so like i said once you start using your pioneer account to receive usd now you can now um, easily withdraw this usd to your local bank account and withdraw it to your local currency so what you want to do is you can either add your personal accounts or add your business accounts so i'm going to choose personal then enter my personal account so we can proceed so once you've done that the final thing you have to do is just come over here then click on submit so once you click on submit you're going to review your account 
then send an email to you when your account has been activated now this is just a tutorial account i have an account with them already so i just want to show you how you can get it done yourself so the next thing i'm going to do now is go back and log into my own personal account then show you how you can gain access to your usd bank account inside your pioneer account so this is my account so all i have to do is just click on sign in so we can proceed so as you can see i've just logged into my pioneer account so once you've created your own pioneer account and your account is being activated so if you want to gain access to your usd bank account what you want to do is you just want to scroll through the currency in your dashboard then select usd so once you click on usd by the right hand side here you're going to gain access to your usd bank account inside your pioneer account so looking at my own here all i have to do is click on view info so when i click on view info it's going to bring out all my banking details so this is the bank name this is the bank address the routing number the account number the account that which is checking and the beneficiary name and the bank address so this is basically how you can create a pioneer account add your own local bank account to it and um, withdraw your funds from your pioneer account to your local bank account so if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and if you are yet to subscribe to the youtube channel please subscribe so you can get more videos like this all right so thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one